I love sharing. I love sharing tips, tricks, techniques. It's these tips and techniques that have made Napoleon Purtis America's newest celebrity makeup artist. You're the makeup artist for the Emmys. I mean, that is a huge coup. Was it a thrill to get that? I'm thrilled. It's exciting. It's a coup. And it's kind of fun. And there's always that little bit of that kangaroo mafia anyway. LA may be famous for the gum leaf gang that supports its own, but it's the Americans that have embraced Napoleon as their own, taking this Aussie bloke from the suburbs of Sydney all the way to the dazzling lights of primetime Hollywood. Does it amaze you to see how Americans have embraced you? I think Americans love the Aussie and the Napoleon in me. The Aussie also is a can-do attitude. It's the DNA of the way we're brought up, you know? Who's your favourite celebrity that you've worked on? My absolute favourite, of course, would have to be Deborah Messing. She's fun, she's cool. Melissa George, of course. I mean, Melissa's just our homegrown girl. The first time you did makeup on an A-list celebrity, were you just thinking, I can't believe this? No. When I finally got to that first celebrity, it was like, oh yeah, she's just another chick. Let's just slap it on a little bit and make her look good. It's this kind of Aussie humour and his down-to-earth nature that lets you know that Hollywood hasn't gone to his head. Napoleon began in 1992 with a small Sydney store. From there, the makeup and the brand has become an empire, estimated to be worth $85 million. Back in Australia to promote his newest makeup line, NP Set. Well, my MP set range is really about on the go glamour. Easy, breezy, you're wherever you are, you can just go and accessorise yourself. So then MP set is like, you can do it on the go. I have three favourite tips. My first one is that mascara is great to do first. Really? Yes, it's the map for the face. The second thing, of course, is like that brown and neutral is the new black and smoky. Following that is that primer is it for me. You know, my. Years ago, I said not to prime is a crime. And whether it's Napoleon Purtis or NP Set, and they are our top products in both lines, it prepares the skin for foundation, it makes things last longer. And is that how you get such a sort of fresh faced look? Yes, primer first, then really light tint of foundation, then a really light dusting of powder. The lashes, of course, and now I'm gonna proceed to use, you know, my palette here, which has the three eyeshadows, the two lips, touch up through the day, on the go glamour, easy to use. And is this a look that you would do on Hollywood celebrities? Absolutely. They want the world to know that this is the way they wake up every morning. <laughs> so it's very contoured, very much about accentuating the eye and keeping the lip. It's very red carpet ready. From the red carpet back to his old childhood home in Sydney's Parramatta. So it's a long way from Parramatta to the glitz of LA. It is, and uh, the Hollywood Hills is a little bit different, but this is home, and I was here for all of my childhood. Does it amaze you to think how far you've come from this to where you are now? I actually feel a bit amazed. Is it true that you've got some pretty fancy neighbours in LA? Yes, some really amazing ones. I mean, name drop, tell uh, me. Oh, <laughs> well, Justin Timberlake's in the neighbourhood and Charlize Theron. And Billy Idol's right underneath. You're living the Aussie dream, you reckon? I think I am.